Okay, I've got my fifth string shelf set up and drying, and I'm going to go ahead and make me another uh, little ebony piece to go on the back of this thing. Uh, in fact, I'll go ahead and get me one to shape it up out here right now. Okay, I've got the little ebony piece cut that's going to go on the back of this neck. Here it is right here. And it's going to glue in right about there. You notice it sticks out a little over the pot, but the ring on the pot sticks out a little over the pot too. And if I if I slide this in, and I'm going to need probably both hands to do this. If I slide this into place, and I hold that neck up kind of firm against that pot, and then I go out here and I look, the level of that neck is very similar to the level of that harmony neck which tells me I'm really close to being just about right with that piece right there. With that said, I'm going to glue that in, let it dry, and we'll come back to it again. Okay, I've got the second ebony piece glued into place on the heel of this old Waverly neck, so that's drying. Uh, this fifth string shelf is drying. When both those two parts get dry, I may be very close to the point where I uh, shape up that fifth string piece and put it on there and then drill a hole in the back of this and put it on the banjo. Line it all up correctly and uh, string it and put some pegs on it and play it. Hmm, won't that be fun? Yes sir. Yes sir.